One of the things I love to do is take a mainstream movie that you wouldn't ever think that there would be a spiritual meaning in and take it and figure one out so that I can talk about it. It makes for great sermons. So one of the ones that I want to talk about today is Pirates of the Caribbean. I told this to a friend and she said, I never would have thought there was something spiritual in those movies. But here it is. So if you haven't seen the movies, there's a, there's a main character named Jack Sparrow. He's a pirate. And he has a compass that everyone says is broken. It doesn't point to north. And they all comment all throughout the multiple movies that Jack Sparrow's compass is broken. But as the movies go on, you begin to discover that the compass isn't broken at all. In fact, the compass points to what you want the most. So who's ever holding it, it points to the thing and in the direction of the thing that they want the most. And I got to thinking about that and I thought, hmm, there's, there's something in that. There's something I want to look at for my own life. And so I started kind of dissecting it. I started thinking about it. And here's what I discovered. We all need a Jack Sparrow compass that seems like it's broken, that seems like it doesn't point to the true north. Because in reality, what is the true north? You know, I think I grew up in a household that wanted me to follow a lot of their beliefs and their ideas about who I should be, what I should look like, what my gender should be, who I should love, and we didn't match up very often. So I didn't really match their true north compass, but they desperately wanted me to follow it. And it was a struggle for a lot of my life trying to find how to figure out to put myself in this box so that I could and would follow these true north compasses. But what this situation made me realize about the Jack Sparrow compass is that's what we've all been missing and that's what we all need is to find that true compass inside of us. That true connection with our own inner guidance that guides us to exactly what we need, what's in our best interest and for the best and highest good that's in front of us. And so I just want to encourage all of us to take a moment to slow down as we're running in our fast paced, busy lives and to reconnect with ourselves, with that inner heart sense of being, the gut that follows our guidance, that knows this is what's right for me. Because that is what enables us to be in our best and highest. And that's what enables us to really follow our own true north, is following our Jack Sparrow compass. The compass that enables us to go in the direction that we've been called to go in not the direction that everyone thinks that we should go in, not to be who other people think we are, but to reach for that best version of ourselves. So think about the Jack Sparrow compass, and maybe next time you're watching a movie, you might pause for a second and wonder, hmm, what kind of spiritual meanings might I find in this? My name is Reverend Alex Regan, and this is my view from the heights.